Hello, my beautiful Capricorns. Welcome to your horoscope forecast for new love in the next three months. I want to thank you guys so much for liking, sharing, subscribing, and thank you to my members. I really appreciate all of your support. And if you guys would like a live person reading with me, go to my website, jenniferwalkerzen.com, or check out the description box below. All right, my beautiful darlings, if you guys like it this way, you want me to continue this way, hit that like button. Let me know in the comments below. You can do both. Let's jump right in. Does Capricorn have huge potential for new love in the next three months? Show me the cards I need to see. Show me the cards I need to see. Let's go to the first card here. Page of Swords. Some of you guys could be dealing with a younger Gemini Libra Aquarius energy. Something about this situation could be something, someone different from a usual type of expectations. Let's get more information here. Influence is a self-focus going on. Maybe some of you guys um, are focused on your finances with the Nine of Pentacles energy. There's something about the situation here in the current, because current is either something that already started to happen or it's happening now. We got the Three of Cups. Some of you guys are gonna be hanging out, having a good time. There's something about this Gemini, Libra, Aquarius energy. Um, let me see, let's keep going here, Capricorn. Influence is travel. Travel, financial travel, Nine of Pentacles energy, isolation or separation, and travel, overcoming some kind of obstacles or blockages. Healing, Six of Swords energy can be healing. It can be long distance, okay. Yeah, there's more than one person around this situation. Something about a work situation, a collaboration, a creative endeavor. Let's more, get more information here. Something about money and finance is influencing your romantic love life or school for some of you guys and travel. Okay, let's keep going. Bottom of the deck, Aries, Sagittarius, Leo energy. Let's uh, keep it going here, Capricorn. What's going on, my Capricorn romantic? Uh, excuse me. Does Capricorn have huge potential for new love in the next three months? Show me the cards you need to see. Show me the cards you need. Two. See. Okay, so this seems like somebody's really loyal and devoted to you. Um. Could be a friend. Doll card energy is a friend. Friendliness. Something that's an influence of a house or home. Yeah, definitely someone seeing you as a main person, Capricorn. Let's keep going here. There's some kind of communication about a house or home, work situation, money, travel, and a sense of financial independence. Bottom of the deck is an infringing party. Let's keep going. Someone sees you as like the ideal partner. That's what I feel like. It's like they see you as their everything, okay? And they're saying that they've waited all their life for this, for you, okay? Wow. That's an amazing message coming through. Okay. Does Capricorn have huge potential for our new love in the next three months? Show me the cards I need to see. Show me the cards I need to see. Yeah, something in the current is looking good here. Let's go the obstacle or blockage here. There's a strong temptation towards an Aries, Sagittarius, Leo energy, and a Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces energy. So it seems like um, there's something about romance and an attractive energy. Some of you guys may feel like you have a destined connection or you're trying to listen to your intu intuition or you're not seeing some kind of signs here about somebody, about a loss. Something uh, that you haven't discovered yet, something that you're not um, aware of yet. Because this talks about spiritual signs again, something that could surprise you. But you see how like there's like these dark clouds around this and it's showing like something you're not quite seeing here that you're going to discover that's going to be successful for you when it comes to your romantic love life. It's definitely seeing somebody's looking at you like, oh my God, Capricorn, you're so sexy. You're so sexy. You got a cat in there. And it's like, oh, I can see success. 
All right, what, what kind of foundation you've been building? Okay, so there are some rosy colored glasses. You guys have a sense of confusion here because of some kind of choice about a Cancer Scorpio Pisces energy. Seems like there's been some healing going on. Maybe some of you guys have been feeling like somebody's been using for money or something about money and finance is playing a part in this. Yeah, I see that there is somebody that maybe was left out in the cold. Let me see, but the worst of this is over. Now there's a sense of focus, but there's still this focus on the past. You see, it's not focused on the future. This cat's going backwards here. What happened in the past? Let's find out. So there was some type of thoughts, plans. There was some flirting going on. It seems like somebody wanted someone else to follow them. They were like, hey, come this way. Hey, come this way. But then there was somebody got, that got in between the situation. Somebody got in between the situation. It caused an issue with you going down a certain path. And then it caused a lot of self-doubt here with the Nine of Swords energy. Now, if that's not you, Capricorn, it could be the other person. But we see there were people around this. You see that there's people around this? And somebody who caused some kind of issue here. But there was somebody you had very deep, deep emotions for. They may have also had it for you. There was some kind of discovery about this. It was like an amazement about this situation. There was something unusual about this. Okay, so let's keep going, Capricorn. What's going on, my Capricorns? Uh, excuse me, is Capricorn have huge potential for new love in the next three months? Show me the cards I need to see. Show me the cards I need to see. All right, Capricorn, let's take a look. Yep, there was some, oh, okay, in the near future. Could be, could be a passionate situation coming about here. I told you they found you very sexy. Mm-hmm, okay. Obstacle or blockages is concerned about manipulation or are, are you being tested? Are they being a player? Okay. Yeah, there, there definitely is a foundation of a twin flame, a spiritual connection, somebody you connect it with. The blockage, or excuse me, the past was addictions, obsessions, strong attachment. Now, th there could have been somebody who had some addiction issues, okay? That's, that's very possible because there was something here that caused some self-doubt. Now, that doesn't necessarily have to be an infringing party, but definitely there was some kind of issue here that caused some uh, blockage of this path with this person. Okay, um, now your goal. Now, this talks about beauty and attraction, okay? Empress, some of you guys may want to start a family. Um, maybe you have concerns about a mother energy in a relationship, which you don't want to deal with. Um, it seems like you really want to connect with somebody on a spiritual level here. And it's like you want the right opportunity, Three of Wands energy. Yeah, there's a, there's a, there's a concern about appreciation in your thoughts. Maybe you didn't feel like in the past that someone really totally appreciated you. Yeah, there was like this kind of rejection going on. Okay. Near future here. Oh, this looks good. This looks good. All right. This talks about a house or home close to home. You're about to get what you want. Nine of Cups energy shows a, a wish being fulfilled here, Capricorn. And I see that there is something about a new person here, full card energy, or someone who's ready to take a risk. Now, there's a sense of regrets. Somebody could be dealing with regrets about a marriage here. Let's keep going. Also, let's make sure we put that. Yeah, you want the truth. I feel like maybe you didn't have the truth in the past. Yeah, something's about to come to light here. Something's about to come to light. That is going to throw a wrecking ball into another situation that's going to give you what you want. Hmm. So far, what do we got? We got... Passionate situation, but the concern is manipulation when it comes to a soulmate twin flame kind of uh, relationship and addictions to this rejection and concerns about an obstacle blockage or a wrecking ball around this. Okay, subconsciously, 
you're dealing with this travel situation and you're not sure if you are going in the right direction and there's this concern about a loss of responsibilities and being stuck in the middle and wanting to receive something of value or worth here towards this new beginning because you're, you're still dealing with a lot of unresolved regrets Capricorn um, I see like there's this sense of mistakes from the past that needs to be worked on obviously because this is these two areas right here are these obstacles or blockages to new love okay coming back to the influence there's a self-focus going on, isolation or separation, still healing. Maybe some of you guys are really focused on work. We see there's something about a house and home. Maybe some of you guys are just spending a lot of time at home. And there is some kind of communication coming in. There seems to be this lack of trust here as the influence. Yes, thank you for that confirmation. Yeah, look at that. I picked up the wrong deck, but it says doubt, some doubts. Right, um, let's go further. Yeah, that someone's lying. <laughs> or, you know, like, not telling the truth. All right. So let's come here to this card. Then I want to come back to the card of where could you meet this person. So first we need to see, are you meeting someone? Hmm. You're at a crossroads here. About ending a tough cycle and overanalyzing this. You're getting attention here, though, but it seems like you're still dealing with something from before. Let's go further. You need to take some actions here to resolve some stuff, but there is somebody who has feelings for you around this. So you're having a state of confusion because you have a lot of options. And there's something about this clarity about this work situation, okay? And there's, there's a surprise about somebody from before or something you do, do, do on a regular basis because it's something you're familiar with as far as where you can meet new love, okay? Yeah, somewhere you love to go. And it deals with money and finance, okay? For some of you guys, it could be something you buy stuff at, okay, you go, you purchase stuff at, okay, something about it involves money transactions. Okay, so let's bring it together. Passion and hookup, concerns about player energy. We see a relationship and addictions, rejecting a situation. Um, there's some issues here because of this regrets and lying about this financial situation, but having strong feelings. So it seems like there's some complexities around this. Let's go down another layer. It seems like you're still kind of dealing with somebody from before I don't I don't feel like this is brand brand new love thank you for that confirmation yeah success uh, amazed uh, someone wants to come back from being out in the cold strong feelings truth something comes to light this new beginning is not trusting in love and you need to take some action so you're not trusting in your love not that you're not you don't have options but you're not trusting in it because you you have some kind of uh, divine connection okay and you're like I want to move forward with my divine connection seems like to me all right let's keep going see see what I'm saying the ending card is the death card okay so me there is somebody that sees you as a main person but there's this concern about a loss of finances or money or taking some kind of money we see an infringing party and thoughts regrets receiving something of value letter message document with somebody from before and we see an ending so the because somebody from before is going to end this possibility of new love for you guys in the next three months, okay? I'm just being real. But I will get some advice because it's saying here, you have options, okay? You see three of pentacles, more than one person. Temptation will come in, can cause you confusing in your thoughts of waiting for the right opportunity when it comes to a new person because the burden of responsibility or weighing heaven you. We see a money situation and a state of confusion in ending that. So it does seem like whoever that new person could be would be around money and finance or work. But this other person that you have this spiritual connection with, you're, it's going to kind of get in the middle of that. Okay, so let's get you guys some advice if you're interested in brand, brand new. I know you didn't want to hear that about the other person. <laughs> some of you got the friends out there like, I want new love, I don't want to deal with that other person again. I know I hear you. So that's why we're going to do advice for it. All right, so you guys can confirm that in the comments below. Don't come at me, okay? I have to just read what's here. All right, so 
how can uh, Capricorn, if they're interested in brand, brand new love, what can they do at this time to make that happen? What steps can they take? How many cards do you see? Show me the cards I need. Two. Let's see. Okay, Capricorn, let's find out. So you got to just let it go, okay? You got to let it go, okay? Focus on a friendship here and get disciplined about it. All right, thoughts and plans. Focus on healing and forgiving. You're going to get sad, okay, and cause doubts here because of a jealousy situation with another person. Focus on the purpose here. Change in relationship, okay. And give it some time. Be patient, okay. So you see that there's some waiting around, some balancing and accepting this, and don't worry. Trust it. Trust the process. Remember, the reason why the new love is going to be issued because it was trust issues. You can have success here. It will grow. <laughs> Okay, my beautiful Capricorns, I love you guys so much. If you guys like it this way, you want me to continue this way, hit that like button. Let me know in the comments below. I'll see you guys another day or two. Have a great rest of your next couple days, and I will see you guys soon.